good morning. Hope you're all having a great day wherever you are in the world. Car. Yeah, we're uh, we're not at Rugeley Town this morning. We're actually on the main road. Because, like I told you uh, a couple of vlogs ago, uh, our line on the Trent Valley is shut now for a week. We have no service between Rugby and Stafford. Now, there's through a couple of reasons. Uh, reason number one, they want to resort the signalling out at Colwyn Junction. And reason number two, they want to sort out the drainage at the junction at North Ham, uh, sorry, uh, Nuneaton, where the, uh, whew, hold on, I've got to get my breath there a sec, where the trains to uh, Leamington go. So they've shut the whole thing off for the week and uh, basically we have replacement buses on our line as well. I don't know why they've shut our line off, but they have. Now the replacement is only from Rugeley to Henson, but that won't stop us getting to our destination today, Coventry. Because all the Avanti services are now going through Coventry and Birmingham International. Which is good, because we can get Liverpools, we can get Manchesters. Freight goes through there as well which is awesome. So we should be in for a cracking, cracking day of diverts. So we're just gonna go down to our bus stop to pick up the rail replacement bus. I don't know who's on it. It could be anything, it could be anyone. And we'll, uh, we'll get to Hensford for the uh, 929, I think it is. Champion. Uh. So here's our bus stop uh, for the week. Rugeley Town Station is up that street there, about two, three minutes walk up that way. And we have to veer to, oh, there's a bus coming. There is a bus coming, now what is this? Is this a rail replacement or is this the chase rider? Ah, this is a chase rider. I think. Yeah, Chase Rider, 828. Uh, eight eight. It's one of the Urbans, isn't it? Yeah, it's one of the Urbans. No, it's a Scania. So this is the stop here to go to Hensford. And then over the road, over there, is the stop to go to uh, Rooshi Trent Valley. And I'll just sit here and wait, because this actually smells like hot chocolate in here. Gorgeous. <coughs> what do we got? Who are you? Oh, you're joking, not an urban this early in the morning. Oh my God, it's a chase rider urban. <laughs> Yeah, but the, the two on the round the bend. Two on the round about, lovely. Yeah. Cheers. Bye. Uh, no, no, you've got to go round the corner. Okay, round okay. the corner for the rail rep. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Where are you? There you are. What are you? This early in the morning, 7.37? 7.37 I think. 
That tells me they're coming in over Marston Green. Okie dokie. What's not okie dokie uh, is the fact that I've got a 350-2 this early in the morning. Two five two, and you know what that means, don't you? That's class bash. the horse you rode in on. It's f why is it full? your overcrowded train. I saw a Transport for Wales car I like the look of. <laughs> it's 15882... Oh god, I can't make out that number. Is it a three? I think it's a three. near what is going to be the site of Curzon Street Station for um, High Speed 2. Looks like it's uh, coming along very nicely. Glorious Sprinter. They got me here, unlike London North Shetland. What is that doing here? What, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Oh, here it is, getting ready to go. Glorious sprinter. A glorious sprinter for Tico. Hit it.
right then. Please let me on this. Don't be full. Come on. Because I don't fancy uh, what's behind it. Come on. Please don't be full. Stay right behind the other line, please. I am behind the other line. I'm well behind the other line. Thank you. Right. 220028. Good. Right then folks, we have arrived at our first station of the day. This is the COV, Coventry. It's operated by Avanti West Coast and has four platforms and is one of the interchange stations on this stretch of line. And thank God I've got here. <laughs> no, ser seriously, I, I, I kid you absolutely not, right? I, I don't kid you when I say this. The London Northwestern I was going to get was absolutely rammed to the point it was a health and safety violation so I had to get the transport for Wales and then had to get the <clears throat> remember that um, so yeah we had to get um, and then cross country down to here so thank god we did it's all good Anyway, here for an hour, and then we're off to uh, Canley.
Ah, it's Canley. Good old Canley. Oh, sun's out. Sun's out, must be good. So we are now at Canley Railway Station, folks. It is operated by West Midlands Trains and has two platforms. And I consider Canley to be the second worst station on this stretch for obvious reasons. I think you've, uh, you've probably already seen. It's not the best. The, it's not the worst either out of this stretch between International and uh, Coventry. The worst is yet to come, in my opinion. And I think a lot of people will agree with me. Now, we also may have to take out Master Green. Because we got here half an hour late, thank you West Midlands Railway, it's looking not likely that we're going to be able to get uh, Marston Green done before we have to get back home. Because I'm on a bit of a tight schedule today. So, and, and the problem is I can't then put Marston Green in unless I do it on a day myself. And unfortunately, guess what? I've already took all the stations out in this area. So unless I do like Birmingham International twice or something, or go visit Birmingham International Airport again, uh, can't do Marston Green. So, uh, it was me, with my head a bit concaved on one side than the other, uh, maybe. So anyway, we're here for an hour, and then we're on to our next station of the day, which will be Tile Hill. Is it dry? Yeah, it looks dry. It looks very dry to me. Hey, and so we are now at Tile Hill Railway Station. It is operated by West Midlands Trains, has two platforms, and this is the best. Without a doubt, this is the best station on this stretch. If you ever do come here, this is the station you want to come to. 
because it's absolutely straight down that way it's absolutely straight down that way nothing uh, like it now we got two freight trains at canley we're going to get two here and believe it or not it's both of the moss end daventries the down moss end daventry and the up moss end daventry and believe it or not i think they're due to pass at the same time <laughs> Today is the day that keeps on giving, and that's what I love about diver days like this. Anyway, here for an hour, and then we're off to our next station, Berkswell. No update my day has now been ruined i tried to get on that train that just came in and no one was moving away from the doors and then as people were still trying to get on the guard fucking disappeared off ridiculous he could see people trying to get on the fucking train and well now i'm stuck here i'm stuck here now that is, that is a whole day absolutely fucking ruined. I'll tell you ridiculous. I, I'm going home. I am. I'm, I'm fucking going home. You don't fucking do that. That's just stupid.
Ugh. I managed to talk myself out of it. Ugh. At least I've got uh, this here now. <sighs> here we are then folks at Berkswell. West Midlands operated two platforms. Managed to talk myself out of going home. So it's it's ridiculous, right? That train that I should have got on at Tile Hill was an absolute disgrace. Absolute disgrace. How they can justify, right, people crowding around the door, right? It's a three fifty two, double three fifty two, plenty of seats, and they're all crowding around the door and the guard's just there like oh he's like And he's supposed to be in charge of the health and safety of people on that train. If he's not fucking even doing that, then... No, I, I'm going to stop. Because if I, if I don't stop, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go off on one. And I'll be going off on one at the wrong person. It's a joke. But then I look on the real time. And apparently, it's all fucked down south. Watford to Houston's fucked. So, pat ourselves on the back for that as well. <sighs> oh well. Here for an hour and then we'll go to Hampton and Arden. Because Hampton and Arden, it always gets shat on, but not today. Not today. It won't be shat on today. Oh my god, I've got to get on it. Uh, freight train's gone. And it's a good old Hampton in Arden. Ow! Oh, my knee almost came out then. Jesus, well. Uh, well, here we are at what could be our final station today. It could not be. I don't know. But it, it is Hampton in Arden Railway Station. Operated by West Midlands Railway has two platforms and speaks to itself, doesn't it? We've kept up our record of getting freight trains. We've got loads of, we've got, got a couple of freights through here, including a nice shiny red to shed, which is nice. My main concern is with uh, the train that I'm waiting for. No Pendolinos have come up. I know there's problems between Watford and London. But that shouldn't uh, justify the fact there's no trains that have come up. That shouldn't justify it at all. And if that is the reason why there's no trains that have come up, then, well, somebody's in trouble. Because that means that my train will be the first train after the previous London, the train to Birmingham. That's a de Havilland. The Haviland Canada Dash 8, I think. Yeah, so my worry is that this train coming in could be absolutely rammed. And if it is, we ain't doing mass. Well, we'll ditch the train at Birmingham International and we'll go. So, uh, yeah. Let's see what happens, shall we?
Oh, hello. Look, hello. I hate myself, I hate myself, I hate myself. This is Marston Green Railway Station. Westminster Railway operated two platforms and yet I, I really hate myself here because I've talked myself into doing this station. All the disruption that is going on down that way and I have talked myself into doing this. Ugh. This is only gonna go one way and one way only and we know which way it's gonna go. Not good. Um. Just over my shoulder, over here, is Birmingham International Airport. Uh, they're all coming in from the north. So we may be able to pick up a few planes as well. I don't, uh, or as uh, Tico refers to them, flying metal pigeons. <laughs> or flying metal gooses, let's go with that. Anyway, here for an hour, or however long we are, and then uh, it's home time.
remember when I get down here, the cart has arrived. It has not. Because apparently the Wolverhampton is first. I come on the wrong platform. I think I might be on the wrong platform. I see a donkey in the reflection. Is this my donkey? I hope it isn't. <laughs> Actually, I hope it is. Which one are you? 350 feet at five. You're going. The other one behind you, you're going that way. I do that with the ball behind you, don't at me. Yeah, please all run now. Miss me. This is me, 350-401. Now, I have to be at the front for this. I have to be. Oh, although, hang on. What if it goes out the other way? No, it's come in this way, so it should go out that way. this way so it should go out that way shouldn't it yeah that's what it should do Trying to find me something that says Chase Rider. Please don't be the other. Street light. Okay. Okay. I see you there, uh, Chase Rider. Street light. 62 play. I believe this is one of the ex-Londons as well. Is it number 66? It is number 66. Let's see how this thing goes then. So there you have it then folks oh, excuse me while well, I uh, burp a little bit I'm about ready for uh, for my dinner I think overall you know what it didn't go too bad we got uh, plenty as we say six in total done today Coventry, uh, 
Coventry, Canley, Tile Hill. Tile Hill we're not going to speak of because that was just pathetic. And then Burks. Well, I should have knocked it on the head after Tile Hill with all the delays that were coming up. But uh, I didn't. And I'm glad I didn't. Because uh, Burkeswell, Hampton and Arden and Master Green actually uh, came out alright, I think. Not too bad. But anyway, guys, I'm going to end it before I get back into my estate. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. Don't forget to... Oh, dear me. Oh, dear. There we go. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already done so. We have memberships as well. 2 99 You get the vlogs early. You get uh, your name shouted out at the end of the vlog. Plus I'm cheaper than Simon. What more can you say? But uh, yeah, I'm going to end it now. Thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoy. I don't know where we're going next because... Quite frankly, I need to plan it. So, uh, yeah. We'll see you all next time.